Hey everybody, welcome back to Dome Keeper. I am addicted. <laughs> it's really enjoyable. Uh, we've had some great runs and uh, a lot of kind of nail biters in there, so it's been a blast. We're playing uh, with the Sword Dome again. It took me a while to get used to it. I for sure thought we were going to fail, and uh, we were able to pull it out, so that was beautiful. We have a new gadget here called Repellent. So we have a tank that produces a monster repelling liquid activated to spray it outside the dome, delaying the next wave of attackers. Now, doesn't mean the attackers aren't coming. Don't know how long that delay is. Don't know the best way to use it, but we will try to figure that out. Now, uh, we've got some different modifiers that we can use here. And it looks like you could maybe have, like, I, I don't know if you can have multiple. See, there's kind of like some color residual that stays on these borders. Uh, but I'm gonna just do the long cycle, so we'll do these in order like we said. I'm gonna do a medium map size, and, uh, we'll try to maybe go up through map sizes as well. We'll stick on Brutal, and, uh, that's all we can do. Okay? Let's rock and roll. Boom. That's one down. Okay, let's get to work. I'm using a keyboard for some reason. Don't do that. Okay. So, already in the bottom left, things are a little different. I'm going to take these four up right now. And I'm going to grab our first upgrade. So, do we need proximity? No. Let's take drill strength right now. We'll take these also. I imagine that thing on the left is for the repellent. Usually they just kind of add something new in your base you need to check out. Okay, we've had a pretty decent chunk here. Finding a ton of materials. I expect with the larger map size, the runs to be a bit longer. Therefore, maybe we get into some of the higher tiered upgrades. Wow. But that does mean we're going to need more of the cobalt to sustain us. That's that's my that's my impression. And then with that foam, do I want to be here? I'm actually going to turn on the proximity meter here. Yeah, see, look how much time we have. That's crazy. That bar underneath, I don't know if that's to do with the repellent, maybe? Look at this now. Okay. I thought maybe that would go beyond the walls. Also, very close to have a dead end there. There's been some uh, chat in the comments about, yeah, well, I don't think you should do three apart. You should do two because you can miss out on some of the minerals. But I also feel like the minerals are very rarely on their own. So, like, I agree in the sense that uh, there, in theory, could be a batch of minerals right down the middle of a three-spaced uh, section. But I think the chances of that are, are quite low, and I'm, I'm willing to I'm willing to kind of accept that. Okay, I've actually, I'm just going to stay here. We're cool. Let's do uh, one of these. Let's do the carry slowdown. Okay. And we'll battle. That's rough. That is rough. <laughs> okay, well. After you come away with, like, all the upgrades and stuff, kind of changes things a bit. Also, I should definitely work on having a more consistent exploration pattern. How's this feel? Actually, carrying six this close isn't feeling too bad. 
But the other thing with like the exploration patterns, it's it's a weird thing for me, but I feel like if I do it the exact same every time, then it, it kind of feels like it could feel a bit monotonous. So I, I do appreciate the little bit of randomness there, which with just like the thought in the back of my mind as, you know, try to be somewhat sticking to the rules we set for ourselves. Okay, so pretty good amount of minerals so far on this medium map. Um, I'm not really feeling the huge difference in map size yet. I actually feel like this one feels super narrow, like we've reached the outside edges a little bit faster, but to be fair, we've only reached that left edge. So we might have a lot of space on the right, I don't know. Either way. Yeah, see how that... This is like filling up over there. I'm just gonna snag the health meter. And this here repairs 50% of total HP. And then 50% here. So I don't know if they did another patch. They must have because I think this was 100 before. Um, it's interesting when you play stuff that's early. Okay, here, the repellent. Wave delay, 0.2 cy cycles, but it takes two cycles to produce a new batch. Activate the sprout inside the dome, delaying the next wave of attackers. You can delay it for 0.3 cycles. Debilitate. Sprays a numbing mist during battle that slows all monsters down. Lasts for eight seconds. And then production speed. Use water to overcharge your tank. Okay, 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 okay. We're going to try it like vanilla for a second, and then we'll go from there. Uh, the aim line for uh, shooting is actually quite nice with the sword dome, I find. And then maybe I'll just take, like, a slice improvement here. Okay, I can still get to work. Repellent is ready to delay the next wave. So that is that bottom bar. drop that one if you're wondering like how to determine how many things to carry for me I'm just doing it on feel like if it just feels impossibly slow then I'm gonna I'm gonna switch it up and then you kind of you drop to a certain threshold and you almost you, you can feel the weightlessness kick in if that makes sense okay That'll do. Let's cruise. Okay. So we have some decent amount of action out here. Okay, so this seems to be our right-hand side. Let's try and get a, a drill upgrade going here. We might have some materials to the left. You can see that little residual there, but yeah, nice. This is all really thick sedimentary rock, but look at this. What's this paying off? Okay, so we're going to take these six. I can't remember if I have any leftovers. It seems like the, you know, because of the larger map, maybe we're getting just so many more materials. So maybe getting this counter in could be kind of nice. Yeah, and you know what? I'll, I'll take it just as a nice to have there. So now in the bottom left, we've got the inventory displayed all the time. And then I still have enough to get my higher drill strength. And let's rock. I am interested to try that maze modifier. I think that'll be kind of cool. Because it's a maze already, but if it's all dead ends, it's almost like, you know.
know, take some of the decision making off of me. I just have to kind of do what it, where it's guiding me almost. See, like, what I was talking about earlier, there could be, like, there could be minerals in that middle section. But I just feel like I'm willing to take the quote-unquote risk. To be able to uncover as much of the uh, map as possible. Because remember, the main goal here, the main goal, oh, it's going to break. The main goal is to just get the relic and get out, right? So it's not about being, it's not about being perfect. My sword's feeling quick and mighty right now. Well, I definitely, I definitely spent too much time in here. I could have, uh, I could have went and just hit some blocks below. I think it's the same, uh, it's the same segments. It's just that the segments disappear faster. Or slower, I should say. Well, that was a, that was a nice quick turn that I made there. Okay. I'm just gonna dig straight down-ish. See what we can find. There might be some cobalt under where I dropped that one as well. This is nice, this is a nice little sequence. Okay, dead end, but we have soft floor here. I'm just gonna drop this all. Let me see if I can let that settle and then I don't have to carry it as far. We haven't found any upgrades. And I imagine those are gonna be the complicated things to try and find on uh, larger map sizes. But it's also possible that there's more of them. Okay, that stuff takes too long. Just nothing, hey? No action at all. Okay. Now, I'm gonna try... something here. Let's take these back, and I'm gonna hit my repellent. What I'm expecting for that to do is to move... See how there's like a, a certain size of the repellent? I feel like it's going to increase the bar by that amount. Just so I get more mining time. Oh, okay. Yeah, so essentially, essentially doing the same thing. It puts that on pause and then uses the bottom bar instead. Which means I should pretty much just use that... Whenever it's up, I guess. See if there's anything in this large chunk here, because it's all solid walls. Yeah, so efficiency-wise, pretty much just use that whenever it's up. And then maybe if you're trying to squeak out the last little bit of the... Uh, relic or something you could get away with that uh long stab what's the one that gives us the ability to shoot to hit like multiple things probably long stab retract speed extend cooldown plus one second hmm arrowhead size Shield, pad size, sword agility, minus one. Don't know if that's good, but the reflection could be kind of interesting. I'm going to take a long stab, and then I'm just going to hit some close stuff here. You never know. We'll clear out this kind of opening. All right.
We're sitting on four cobalt. It's not bad. Oh, there we go. I'm gonna have to focus on slicing here. Okay. Not too shabby. I just want to get deep here. See if I can find anything interesting. Let me take this with me. Oh, finally. Oh! Okay. Well, that is great news. But what's not great news is getting through the rest of that is very tedious. Because not only are we deep, but then we've got that thick rock. So, I need to prioritize getting my drill strength upgraded. So, I think I need like 12. Take all of these. That's huge, though. That's huge. I feel like those are the best kind of runs in my limited experience where obviously we find something and get lucky there. I don't think this is going to be cobalt now based on what we're seeing. And we were correct. Uh, can we not break this? That's the other thing, is those tangles aren't a huge deal until they are. But I'm still going to be short. So it's not going to be very efficient for me to get down there. And we still don't have any upgrades, which kind of sucks. But yeah, 12 is my next one. Which is fine, like, my, my speed and my, uh... And my carry slowdown are less important now that we've identified that space. Uh, let's just see if I can find some easy minerals somewhere. I don't think so. I'm just going to clear out the rest of this stuff. I can't really go any deeper here. I need to be ready to fight. It is weird because you're, you're kind of condition to have a certain expectation you see like how many segments are left and then you're like well okay i know i need to be in there now or i'm gonna be late you know nice Okay, that was, um, not great, because I'm definitely going to need to do some repairs. But we haven't used any cobalt yet, so it's also not the end of the world. Um, but, oh, sick. This is a huge haul. Oh, and an upgrade. Perfect. Alright, let me take, uh four and I can grab my drill speed now what would I like to see here um I don't know what would be best because we already know where the relic general area is we just need to find the relic itself okay so we've got the teleporter I think we want the teleporter because we know where the relic is I just, then my speed is irrelevant, and I can just simply get down to the relic, bop it out, and get out of here. Two-way teleporter with a station under the dome and portal that can be placed and moved around the mines. Yeah, the lift is alright, but I would take that if we didn't know where the 
relic is, I think. Okay. Now, do I want to do... Well, I'm not going to be able to do any upgrades because I just spent all my iron. But uh, having these would be okay. So, we can teleport both ways right now unless we do that upgrade. So let's take this down. We have plenty of time, but, but I need to do some repairs when we get back. Uh-oh. This is not the spot. Uh-oh. We made a bit of a mistake here. Have you sit here. Looks like it's heading in this direction. Oh, interesting. Okay, so is it to the left or is it to the right then? Huh, and we got all these solid walls. Very interesting. No, 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 no. Get this out of here. There we go, okay. I had to double click it. I was like, what is going on right now? <sighs> that was sketchy. Big time. Okay, so we do six here. I can't. Yep, yeah, I can't. If I had that, that would definitely be the way to go. So I'm going to have to blast through the cobalt. Uh, a little bit unlucky. That we don't see exactly where the relic is. It's going to have to do. missed that. Okay, let's go. Oh, I should have, uh, well, I still can, I guess. Man, I, I don't know where this is leading. Like, it looks like it's coming down and going right, right? It's also coming out of that wall, so... Gives me some concern, and then of course I've got dead ends here. Oh. Okay. Found it. This is big. Now, I will have to carry this back. This is enough to do the big dome repair. And look at that. That's definitely going through a dead end. I also wonder if on the bigger maps... Does that mean that there could be more connection points? So we cannot take resources through here. Yeah. But I am going to blast off our repellent here, because I think that's been sitting for a bit. And... 
and we'll get this dropped somewhere around here. And I'm going to take these six because I want to get my dome repair. We should have the time. Might even be able to do with seven. I'll actually... I think I'm going to drop one here. Just to play it safe. This should get us a 50% repair. And some more HP. Which in theory should sustain us through the next one. But we've got some trickery going on with that relic. Okay. No upgrades yet, but I've been using this stuff for other things. Yeah, we are totally blocked here, man. I don't really know what to make of this, other than I might have to go around the blockage. Okay, let's teleport home. That was actually so good. Okay. Yeah, see, like, it has to be going out to the right. But I've never encountered anything like this before. So, I gotta trust my gut that we will be able to break through over there. Yeah, here we go. Okay. Oh! Is that it? Or are there more than two connection points now? One, two... Oh, yeah, there totally are. Okay, so that one was to the... Uh, that one's just to go up. Okay, so there are three. And then on the, on the large map... Four... Oh! Hello. Is this... What is this? You know what? We're going to take this home. We just got a free upgrade, basically. But I don't know what it is. Looks like... I, I'm assuming it might be like the little Drillbert dinosaur egg or something, but... Who knows? Because I feel like the ones you find there, they're just active, right? So if I bring this back, I'm not even sure what it's doing. Oh, is that the seed? Oh, that might be the, the growing seed. And I don't know if that's going to do anything there. That's too bad. Okay. It would be nice if it was clear, but I guess that's just something we need to learn. Is like, what, it, what does it actually look like? Okay, I'm going to drop these. Let's do a quick little teleport. And then I'm going to carry this over here because seconds are starting to matter. And we're going to continue digging to the right.
Okay. Any upgrades I might want here? Um, I might just pop one of these to be safe. And then... Wave delay. I, I think probably the production speed is more important. We can use water to overcharge that. We could teleport resources, but can't teleport you back. But then if I go here, I can get the... I can regain that. And this would basically be six water, five, eight iron. So I'd be a little short there. I definitely want to be able to teleport back. Um, teleport duration is basically instant, but I don't think that's a huge thing that I need right now. Um, and then the monster slowdown, yes, but I could also just increase my weapon stuff. Widen and lengthen the blade, dealing more damage. Slice damage and stab jam damage is increased. More nimble blade, so big agility. And then long stab two, further improve stab strength and more precise control. Hmm. Okay. Maybe I don't need to do any of these at the moment. I definitely want to be able to teleport back. So, yeah. Um, I'll do this. I'll take the teleport time for now. And then I need to have eight to get the, the two-way teleport with resources up and running. Seeing if there's anything I can break here, but it looks like we got it all. Give me the easy rocks. Love that. Our repellent's almost charged. Here we go. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, I did not want to teleport. <laughs> I wanted to carry it. Maybe I can't carry it anymore because it just instantly teleports me. Yeah, that's... Okay. Okay, that's a bit annoying, but... Fine. Whatever. You know, you could have unlocked before I got here. Just saying. Just saying. take the three that we need. We have plenty of time here. No stress. And I say need. I don't think it matters. In my experience, every time we get this, it's just, it's going to end and we're safe. So it'd be interesting to see if there's things that can go wrong after you get it. Also interested to see what we're going to get as unlocks now. So I won't make that mistake with the seed again, I don't think. At least I hope I don't. Okay, so let's do the... Resources. And both of us. Oh, and also... Notice uh, it used up the rest of our thing. So yeah, as soon as you bring that back... It's just, yeah, it's over. Cool. The regular. Don't know what that means. We'll take it. 
So we got a new element, new pet. New pet. And new map size. Pick your unlock. The orchard is a new gadget. Plants a tree in the dome that grows fruits to buff your movement and drill power. Huh. So that would replace the repellent or the dome, right? And then wither. We can all present monsters immediately lowering their remaining health. Wither. I think I gotta take the straight up new gadget. <laughs> okay. Okay, look at this. Pet. Choose your pet. I have a, I have a pet cat now. Look at him just sleep in there. That is cool, I guess. Um, didn't even know that was a thing. Love it. Okay, so our next run, instead of repellent now, we're going to do the orchard. Plant a tree in the dome that grows fruits to buff your movement and drill power. That seems like it's going to be just like... Like it says fruits, but I think it's going to be like iron, I would imagine. Right? And then we'll do... What would we do? Uh, so not long cycles. We'll do maze. <laughs> now, now, switching to a large map for sessions lasting several hours. That that scares me. Uh, I think we'll stick on medium right now while we try the new maze modifier. Just because I feel like, man, that could be literally like hours. Um, and we'll try this and we'll see what happens. So that'll be our that'll be our next run, guys. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you tomorrow. Hope you're enjoying. Bye for now.